right, so we're just pulling up to sub 60. And look at this, you guys. So excited, we're gonna get some new wheels today. It's always an exciting day. Turn this down. It's always exciting when we get some new wheels. Can you guys guess what we're gonna get? We're gonna show you guys. So you'll see like what's like, you know, this machine does by like touchless. Oh, awesome. Yeah. Quite the process. State of the art machine, because you don't want to damage these. And in theory, these aren't the most expensive rims, but they're expensive, but not the most expensive. So you want the best machine to do the job. This is the first time I've ever actually seen a tire mounted by this machine, so yeah, first for everything. GDM wax, okay? Yeah. Right here. Right here. GDM wax. <laughs> Didn't even know there's such thing, eh? My Rooney wax. <laughs> so you know, after we mounted it, your tire can smell like lemon. Oh wow, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Fresh. If it's Korean wax, it would smell like Sarah Oh no, that's Chinese wax. It smells like Sarah Choi, right? <laughs> Oh, Korean, Korean. Korean, oh, so Korean wax. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly. So like the good thing about this wax is that you don't have to put on a lot, a really thin layer. It'll be able to lubricate between the rim and the tire. Okay. And also very easy to clean, so it doesn't drip. Yeah, you don't get all that white stuff everywhere, right? Yeah, you don't. Very clean. Make sure it's nicely lubed. So you don't want to scratch your new wheel. Arms are bigger, I notice. Not as big as, big as Peter Lou. <laughs> Out of his size. <laughs> Up with the ball stand. Oh, I didn't know the that. The yellow one. is the lightest part of the wheel, of the tire. Oh, really? Actually, and the red is the heaviest part of the tire. That's something new. I didn't even know that. So, the best way to check if someone's wheels got properly mounted is to see if the yellow dot is lined up with the ball stand. So, so the dot is still on the uh, the Civic. So we're gonna go back. We're gonna go back and check to see if it's if it's done properly. See the loop here really helped when the the tire is slip touching the rim. Without it, for sure, it's like going to be very hard to get in. Potentially scratch your lip too.
just like that. Brand new rack, brand new wheel. Oh, brand new, eh? It feels so special. Yeah. <laughs> just make sure there's no debris on the rack to scratch the wheel. See, it's true touchless. Machine never touches the rim, only the tires. Pump the air. Heavy loud. That's the only time you want your car to go pop because anything else that goes pop, especially the engine, you'll be crying. Five PSI. Okay. So if we go drag racing, we're gonna drop it down to twenty-eight, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. All right. Now the wheel is mounted. We can move on to balancing. Looks like E-Fans has done this many times. <laughs> Careful, never touch the hub or it might scratch the paint off. So finger play instead of a comb to simulate the lug, actual lug, lug nuts, nuts right? To make sure the, the wheel will be truly balanced. Goes in and it doesn't touch the, any parts of the wheel other than the lug holes. So this pretty much tells you we're half an ounce out? Yep, two. So one ounce in total, which is really good. Look at that, you guys. Sub 60 racing. Mm. <laughs> you even got the laser beam that tells you where to place the, the weight. It just amazes me like there's always there's always a nice car in here and this shop it is so clean like the floors and everything and always got some nice cars of course the fans is in here on well, these stock ones see if you have the red and what's what's with the red and the blue then you fan you know <laughs> I don't know actually. maybe <laughs> yeah, they lined up pretty pretty nicely yeah so I'm not sure what that is, but if you guys do, leave a comment below, let me know what that means. All right, so Yifan thinks it's the heaviest of the tire, lightest of the wheel, and they line up, and that's why they're 
two dots are there. So light, heaviest and lightest. This is when you know they care about your car is when they have a puck instead of just a steel plate. They use a puck. I have this so. too. <laughs> All right, so that's the tire sizes that we're using right now. We uh, 265, 35, 18 on the Advan. What is it, Niova? Niova, yeah. What, uh, what's the number? A A D A D O nine. A D O nine. The newest. Neo A D O nine. There you go, guys. And if you guys are wondering what the uh, specs of the wheels are, unlike Rays, they're not on the sticker. They're on the hub here, so they're 18 by 10. And this is a plus 40. There we go. There we go. And Very the big, nice. the real boss is here. <laughs> no. and, the, uh, <laughs> and the real boss is working and the real boss is watching. <laughs> All right, Lee's back. What do you think? Look nice, eh? It's so nice. It's nice, eh? For all you guys that are always wondering how you fan pays for all his cars. For like this one, this is what he does. Right from the, off the boat. <laughs> exactly. What is that, you fan? I didn't use a gun because I don't want damage to install lock nuts. Yeah. I don't either. I don't use a gun. Yeah. Attention to detail. Always here. Yes. Takes more time, but worth it, right? Yeah. Shortcuts end up costing you more, exactly. more, more money. Exactly. Right? Yeah, I like the way morning. <laughs> money. Yeah, it's interesting you don't use a lock on the wheel anymore. Yeah, I, I would have took it off. Oh, you took I, it off? I don't like No, no, I, I didn't put it on. Oh, yeah, it but, was like no lock anymore. Yeah. This is the first time I ever had the wheel off and check this out, you guys. This is actually like a cooling for your brake ducts. There's a cooling duct here for your brakes. That is, uh, that's pretty neat. First time when it actually comes, oh, you can actually see right through it. Hopefully you can see it there. Right there. Right there. That's pretty cool. I wonder if the other side has it too or not. Oh yeah, this one too. That's something new. That's pretty cool. Lee, you like my uh, lug nuts? That's your lug nuts? The best. I got the best. Yeah? <laughs> chasing Jays. When is uh, Chasing Jay coming? <laughs> I don't know. No idea? No. This is not chasing Jay's eh? This is... <laughs> you want some fancy one? Let's, uh, I don't know, let's put on race for now. Because yeah. these are just temporary. So we're just, oh, just to get us by right now. Just, uh, yeah. I don't know, just, uh, I'll lend you a set of, uh, L42. Okay. Yeah. Just, okay. Just, yeah. <laughs> you don't approve, eh? <laughs> that is so nice of you, fan. Let this me, is let just. Me, let, let me lock this. Uh, yeah, this lug doesn't. Uh, these lug nuts don't do us justice. We're actually waiting for the proper ones to come in. Real nice ones. Uh, so with Evan GT Premium, when you torque down the lug nuts, have to be very careful with the socket size, because the lug hole very tight, and because the hub is very thick. Yeah, there's not a lot of a lot of room, right? Yeah. Or if you're not careful, or if you use a gun, it might just scratch up the inner right away. See how tight it is? Yeah, it is. So I got one more thing to finish off the look. Oh. <coughs> oh, red, interesting. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just like that, Avery. Yeah. Thank you. No problem. Wow, look at that, you guys. Woo! I know the red's a little, but uh, it stands out. I think it's gonna look really nice. Look at that. 
We got the rear ones on. Check out that fitment, you guys. Just flush with a little bit of poke on the bottom now. Woo! Thanks, you fan. All right. All right, you guys. No Make sure you guys uh, go check out Sub 60 Racing like always. Thank you, you fan coming. and Lee. Again, thanks, you guys. They look sick. All right, off we go. What can I say? This setup is amazing, you guys. Uh, let me just show you. Look at that fitment. Just amazing, you guys, in the color combo. So I just want to recap. So the size is 18 by 10 plus 40 offset on the Advan GT Premium uh, Bronze. On camera, it doesn't look, uh, it doesn't give us justice. It's more of like a root beer color, not a not a Pepsi or, or a Coca-Cola. Those are a little on the dark side. This is more of a root beer and it's, it's amazing on the championship white. All right guys, so before I end off the vlog again, thanks to Sub60 Racing for uh, installing the wheels on my car. Uh, make sure you check them out, you guys. It'll be uh, dis in the, the link will be in the dis description below. Fuck, it's too early in the morning, you guys. So the, I'll put the link in the description below uh, for you guys to go check them out and uh, check out my sponsor, Envision Auto Imports, for uh, hooking us up with the wheels, you guys. See you guys next time. See ya.